Welcome to Christina's Kitchen. I'm Christina McFeeders. Today we are going to make a toasted sesame salt. It's kind of similar to a Parmesan, but it doesn't have the cheese flavor. It has an amazing nutty flavor that you can use to sprinkle on salads, uh, spaghetti, pizza, or any vegetable dish. The nice thing is, it's mostly sesame seeds with just a little salt. We're gonna take a half a cup of sesame seeds and put them in a dry skillet and we're going to lightly toast them to bring out the flavor. They may pop and make a little bit of a mess, but it's okay. So we've toasted these sesame seeds until they've turned nicely golden brown. Now they're really hot, so we're gonna let them cool for about 10 to 15 minutes before we grind them and add the other ingredients. Now we have our sesame seeds nicely cooled. We are going to put them in our coffee grinder. And then we're going to add a half a teaspoon of salt. If you want it saltier, you can put more salt in it. You can also put other ingredients in with it, like garlic powder, uh, or even nutritional yeast if you want more of a cheesy flavor. You don't have to grind it completely, just so it's chopped up coarsely. And we're just gonna put it in our little shaker and I'm gonna make myself a funnel. All right, we have it in our shaker and we're ready to eat. And this stuff is amazing. I wish you could smell it right now. It smells so good. But if you don't have the time to make your own, there are companies that make something very similar. This one is by Celtic Sea Salt. It's a toasted sesame seed with garlic and it comes with its own built-in grinder and you can grind it directly on your food. But there's nothing that beats the smell of freshly toasted sesame seeds. This stuff smells so good and tastes amazing. It's my favorite on salads, on spaghetti, on garlic toast, on vegetables. There's so many things that you can use with this and it just adds so much flavor with very little salt.